All right, double blood point weekend. Let's get some points. Oh, you have street mag. I want street mag so bad. Adapter. Jarhead. I want street mag. So badly. Here we go. Double blood points. Haddonfield, swamp. Swamp. Two swamps. Is two slightly is more than a considerably? What are the uh, what are the odds? How much weight does it slightly, and how much weight is it considerably? Is it considerably worth more than two slightlies? Don't know. Isn't there another one that's moderately? I would think it considerably is more than two slightlies. Moderately is probably the same as two slightlies. And we didn't get either one anyway. Didn't matter. Back in the blood lodge again. Just finished facing Michael Myers in the Blood Lodge. Now we're doing it again. All right. Not super happy about this starting position. Somebody's getting hit already. Medkit. Gonna go finish this generator. Is he bringing him to the basement? Not bring him to the basement. Must have trapped him, right? What? He's hitting him? Is he camping him? Must be camping him. If he's crying out again, nobody else is hurt. Look, I'm doing the totem. Come and get me, Trapper. We got him down. All right, he's down. Time for me to go work on another gen. So they're talking about introducing something called Fool's Greed, where you could have an add-on on a on a, a perk or an add-on on a on a totem that would discourage people from taking down totems. That one totem would be like a, a trapped totem that would eliminate one of your perks, just to make survivors think twice about taking down a totem, which is an interesting idea that if I'm risking losing a perk, 
because I take down a totem, maybe I'll think twice about cleansing a totem. Because right now, that's one reason why I don't like the hag, because so many of her perks are tied to totems, and survivors can just take them away from you in the game. I know they feel like they had to do that, because her perks are pretty strong, but they aren't strong if they're out of the game, right? Ah, three o'clock. He's coming now. I'm still going to finish it, bro. I don't care if you're coming. I'm still finishing it. He's chasing somebody anyway. You see the wood flying back there. What's in this box? <laughs> oh no, he tricked me into it. He tricked me into it. <laughs> oh, oh, oh my god. How did that happen? Look out, everybody. <laughs> He's got Sloppy Butcher and traps that make you bleed more. Oh my goodness. Hey. What are you doing, you dummy? Why does he not go for the guy that's in the thing? I'm trying to jump out of this. Is, is this guy ever getting out of the hook? Is this guy ever getting out of the trap? Hello? Thank you. He's not after me? Totally thought he was after me. Oh, it's open. All right, let's go then. Fuck this, let's go. <laughs> 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 
Yeah, baby. Yeah, baby. How you like me now? Come on, let's go. <laughs> Bill ain't got time for your traps. Awesome rescue. I love that one. I love that game. That was a good game. So I got my double on that, right? So it's actually 32k. Yeah. Very quite pleased. That was a fun one. That was a fun one. And not just because you win. I mean, I don't have to win to have fun. I can die and still have fun in the game. I can respect a killer that slaughters you. Of course, it is nicer when you win, but that was a good one. Everybody out. Oh, they wanted the swamp, too. That was a weird one. I didn't think... Like, I was already injured, and I came out of that trap, and I was still walking around. I don't know. I don't know if that... Is that the way it works? Should I have been down to the ground from that, or no? Maybe not. I don't, I don't know. I don't get trapped enough to know. But, uh, he did good... Did a pretty good job of driving me towards that trap, though. So, anyway, that was a good one. Thanks for watching, everybody. Be good to each other. Enjoy your double blood point weekend. Get out there and get some points. We'll see you next time. Bye bye.